Queen Victoria reigned in Britain from 1837 to 1901, and the Victorian age changed Scotland forever. In one lifetime, Scotland's population went from living mainly in the countryside to living mainly in the cities. Scotland's population was 2.3 million people, and they were spread across the whole country, in towns, villages and cities. Crofting was a common way of life, but during Queen Victoria's reign, the Industrial Revolution brought many scientific and technological breakthroughs. Workers operating machines in factories could now produce goods in huge amounts. The factories were mainly in Scotland's big cities. So, as most of the population went to take up jobs, the cities swelled in size. At the same time, landowners in the highlands and islands saw their own chance to make money. The highland clearances meant that thousands of Scots were forced from the countryside to make way for sheep farming. Most of these Scots headed for the cities, while others left to start a new life abroad. Scotland's cities also saw new populations arriving from overseas. The promise of jobs in industries like cotton, jute and shipbuilding brought people from Ireland, Italy and other parts of Europe, all looking for a better life. By 1850, railway lines connected all major towns in Scotland, transporting goods and offering people the chance to travel more freely. Terrible social conditions in Victorian cities meant housing was overcrowded, diseases like cholera were widespread and workplaces could be dangerous. But the Victorians also started to make life better. They introduced maximum daily working hours, lunch breaks and five bank holidays a year. Parliament passed laws to prevent children being used as workers in factories and to make sure they all went to school. Finally, many working Scots were able to make use of the railway and their new bank holidays and have a day off at places like the seaside. By Victoria's death in 1901, there were 4.5 million people living in Scotland. This means that during Victoria's reign, the population of Scotland had nearly doubled. The Victorians gave Scotland lighthouses to make travel safer, inventions like the telephone to make communication easier, and improvements in medicine like antiseptic that help people live healthier and longer lives. <laughs>